Time out. Here we go. All right. <laughs> Ow! So that's weird, but um, hey, so. <laughs> So, um, hey, hey, everyone. Um, this is a sponsored keynote yet again. Um, this is uh, it's a little talk I like to call uh, Open SSF Scorecard. Wow. Oh, my God. Rejects edition. Here we go. <laughs> so have you ever... Um, I'm going to do a little audience participation, hopefully, you know. Um, so have you ever uh, thought about using a project? I think James's talk was a great example of, um, hey, here's all this crazy stuff I did. Um, don't do that, right? So like, pretty much every time I think about writing some code, I, I, I say to myself, do I actually have to write this? Someone smarter has probably written it in the past, right? Um, so one of the things I consider is, is it safe? And like, show of hands, like, uh, you know, what do you think about when you're, when you, when, when you're trying, to, when you're, when you're trying to, to pick up some code? Is that something that you consider, anybody? Cool. Thank. Oh, thank you. <laughs> so, what do I mean by safe? And I think we're all going to have a slightly different definition of of safe. Um, for me, and I think in my role, there are a lot of things that I consider. Right? Um, is the project licensed? Right? And ABPF is a good example of looking into like, oh, we've got licenses for things, so we can do X, Y, Z. Right? Um, d is the project maintained? Uh, this one's big for me. Um, and I <laughs> right? Am I going to be able to pick up this project and 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 know that it's going to have some support long term? Right? Um, do we have a security policy? Are people actively reviewing the code? Is CI, like, are we running CI? Are packages being released? Do we have contributors actually from different organizations? I know this is a, a hot topic if, you're, uh, if you've heard of a little thing called the Cloud Native Computing Foundation. And, um, and is the project maybe attesting to the fact that uh, they're secure or good, right? Whether it's a, hey, we do our code real good, we do all the linty things, hey, it's uh, here's a best practices badge, et cetera, et cetera, right? Um, so these are the quick things. These are things that I, I feel like you could probably figure out in a few minutes, right? And then we go a little deeper, right? It's, it's stuff that you, you can do on a quick investigation, right? If you know exactly where to look, right? Um, what about vulnerabilities? Are we signing the releases, right? Are we updating dependencies? Do we know how the project is updating its dependencies? Um, are they pinning dependencies? I know, again, this is a hot topic, but we're, we're not going to, we're not. <laughs> uh, um, static code analysis tools, right? And um, checked in binaries, right? All, all kinds of important things that you might want to consider if um, your project is, if, is it safe to use? Or is the project that you're considering safe to use, right? And then we go even deeper. Um, and these are things that you might not be able to discover um, about the project because you're not a maintainer, right? Maybe you need to be behind the wall of understanding um, what security vulnerabilities are out, like what advisories are open for the project. Is the project using branch protection? What, what's going on with the coding patterns, GitHub workflows, et cetera, et cetera? Are they using the right workflows, right? Is the project doing fuzzing? Some of the fuzzing information is, again, kind of behind a, behind a login, right? Um, chats about web, webhooks, too, right? Um, so, show of hands, does that seem like stuff that you care about? He's like, oh, come see, come see. <laughs> so, I have great, great news for you. Have you met my friend, OpenSSF Scorecard? Uh, this is a tool that will automate some trust decisions that you might want to make for projects that you're considering and for projects that you're releasing. Right? So if you go to scorecard.dev, we've got a very lovely website that's been put together. Also, github.com slash OpenSSF uh, slash OSSF slash scorecard. Give it a second for cameras and everyone again. OK. Um, so who am I? Um, some of you may know me, uh, but quick highlight reel, I guess. Um, uh, Stephen Augustus, head of open source at Cisco. I'm an OpenSSF governing board member. I'm a scorecard user and maintainer. I'm currently uh, one of the co-chairs for Kubernetes SIG release and founder of the release engineering subproject and reasonably competent re release engineer, right? And if you want to view more about what I do and what I'm up to, and it's um, that is actually not relevant here, whois.augie.dev. 
Now, I mention all of that. Um, I mention all of that because all of those roles, and I'll go back for a second, all of those roles um, have me thinking about how to release code safely, how to use code safely, um, and especially as you know, working on, working on outbound open source, um, I was looking for a project that was, able, was going to be able to automate a lot of the process that my team spends before we release code at Cisco. Right? So, so this is um, seeing folks from Google's OSPO work on this, seeing folks from Cisco's OSPO work on uh, OpenSSF scorecard, as well as lots of other OSPOs kind of like poking around um, the edges. Um, so I have a few humble requests if scorecard seems really cool and hot for you. Um, one, provide us some feedback. Uh, I'll, I'll leave this up as uh, my, my clock runs down. Um, but uh, so there is a link available on the readme at um, uh, github.com slash OSSF scorecard um, of, for a survey. We are looking for, we're looking to do some analysis of personas and actually build in what people want from out of this project. And then second, uh, if you are attending Open Source Summit in Seattle, uh, we've got a day of fun activities planned. It's uh, Sauce Community Day, um, get lost in the sauce. Uh, so securing Open Source Software Community Day, um, and we will be doing a new contributor workshop for uh, OpenSSF Scorecard, as well as lots of fun like security incident response tabletop exercises. So if you're into that kind of stuff, and I know a lot of you are security minded, um, please come check that out if you're attending uh, Open Source Summit Seattle. Thank you.